Thank you for joining me today. Um, I want to bring a story of Tisha Campbell and her husband Dwayne. I know they're going through divorce right now and also bankruptcy, but the bankruptcy trustees believe that Dwayne has um, hidden like $2.6 million dollars he opened a company called uh, Roxy or Rocks LLC and um, to in order to put the funds in of the sale of the house into that company so he can walk away with all the money now they let me read this because I'm not, uh, I didn't remember all of this. The report says trustees alleged Dwayne set up Roxy LLC to alleged conceal on it, allegedly conceal ownership of a 9,000 square foot mansion in Chatsworth, California. Dwayne originally bought the house in 2006 for 900,000 then he borrowed 1.9 million for the purpose of construction constructing the Martin family home what he did is he borrowed that from Will and Jada Smith so they may be brought in to testify now didn't somebody just go to jail and get released and then the husband is serving time right now for trying to uh, falsify information um, to the uh, bank bankruptcy court because that's I'm thinking didn't you learn something if now this is alleged <laughs> but didn't you learn something from that um, both parents one at a time were away from their children because of this okay let me let me uh, continue this. Unfortunately, Dwayne then defaulted on his loan to negotiate a short sale with the bank and he used Roxy to buy the home back from the bank using a $1.4 million loan from Will and Jada Roxy LLC became the owner and Dwayne and Tisha allegedly entered into a lease with their own company to pay the rent of $5,000 per month. Okay, now he's listing the house for $26,950,000, no, $2,000,000, I'm sorry, $695.00 with the intention of pocketing the profit and unfortunately Will and Jada will be under that bankruptcy so they can kiss their money goodbye if all of this is the truth if all of this is accurate and I and I do believe it um, I've gotten stories um, from uh, what is this um, blackamericaweb.com before and so uh, they get their they have their sources also which another source is the blast a publication so i put i put the link in the comments for you to read the whole story but <sighs> this is a mess for them it is a mess for them because if it proves he's trying to do all this, he's going to jail. I mean, bankruptcy court, they don't play. And if they think you've built a company with the intent of putting funds in that company, you know, for LLC and then, but you have access to that company and then you're paying rent to a company because uh, read read the story because this is so messy and divorces period without all this divorces are messy period i mean she's I don't know. looking for um full custody of the children along with spousal and um 
spousal support and also child support, but he's also looking for the same thing from her. So you would think after all this time of marriage of 21 years that they would have more of a line of communication than what they do. But you know what? It gets ugly when you go through a divorce. It's like you don't even know that person anymore. They pull in stunts that's like, who are you? Um, so I don't know, you know, what things were involved, whether they had a prenup or not, and whether he actually, that's the rumor, you know, allegedly, but that's what, you know, he built this, he, he, formed this company and then they're bringing Will and Jada Smith in it because they borrowed money and then it doesn't look like Will and Jada is going to get their money unless, you know, the bankruptcy court um, throw everything out. Um, unless, well, it depends on what chapter two. I'm not really, I would have to I don't know. I guess somebody, I guess the attorney's going to straighten that out because in one bankruptcy, you can do one thing, and then another bankruptcy, you know, because there's Chapter 7 and Chapter 13, so I'm not really sure what they actually file to see whether they're going to just liquid liquidate things and then pay all the debtors out or everybody just... I don't know how that works, you know. I don't know how the Chapter 7 and 13, you know, I'm, there's differences, so I'm sure their attorney is there on it. But it just seems a shame because... I, it seems like uh, a lot of this these problems were forming when Martin says, you know, he's trying to get the Martin show up and up and running again, and people are saying she's divorcing Dwayne because she wants to be on the show. But I haven't heard anything more about Martin getting that show together, so I don't know. You know, that might have just been a thought, and maybe they all came together to see what the possibility. You know, so I don't know if it's still in the works or not. But it just seems, like I said, it just seems like a shame after 21 years. And, you know, you just really don't know a person when it comes to divorce. Things just get ugly. So, like I said, I'll read you the link, uh, the, uh, link because I want to make sure I got my facts um, straight. Um, it's late right now, and I saw this story, and at first I wasn't going to do it, but I said, well, people might be interested, you know. Um, I was, I'm was i working on another story, and I'm trying to figure out some copyright things, you know, to see whether it's worth me um, going that route. So, you know, that's... Um, I'm doing that right now. I'm, I'm, in, I'm in the edit, editing stages, so I figured, you know, while that's still... Uh, uploading um, maybe I'll just bring this this story to you but uh, be assured I'm going to leave the information in the link so you can read the story it just seems like a big mess and you know once you begin in that um, you know you you think couples can maybe uh, reconcile but after some you know after so many things are said and so many things are done, you get to the point where it's like, you know, too many things has happened, so there's no turning back. So, you know, maybe, maybe not, but it just seems like, you know, the divorce is going through and nobody have backed uh, down or asked for counseling, to my knowledge, to my knowledge. So, anyway, thank you for joining me, and as always, if you have not subscribed, please do so now and click the notification bell, and I'll make sure that I leave that link so you can read up on this story if you're interested. Thank you so much. Have a good evening. Goodbye.